The first thing to notice is on the weekly chart that while we are underneath the market bias, which is not a good sign, market structure is still holding bullish. If we take our swing low down here of about $263 on Monday the 11th of 2023 in December up to our highs of Monday the 4th of March in 2024, you're going to notice that the golden pocket is sitting right here between the 0.618 and the 786 between prices of 430 and 560. This institutional level is very important because when we get these pullbacks, this buy zone is usually when we can see institutions step in and start to save the stock. You can notice that last week, price held within that institutional buy zone. This week, it looks like price is going to potentially bounce within that institutional buy zone. If we go into the daily chart, you're going to be able to see this a little bit clearer, and you're going to notice this bottom a lot better here. You're going to see on the daily chart, while we're inside of that institutional buy zone, we're now making higher lows on the BX trender. This is very, very important because when we make higher lows on the BX trender, it's showing that buying pressure is coming into the bottom. If you're not buying when buying pressure is happening, then you're just buying into a falling knife if you're trying to catch the bottom. You have to wait until there's serious money coming in behind this or we're gonna see price continue to fall off. I will say that while I think SMCI short term is most likely going to bounce, back to 650, 675, best case, I think 725. I do think that we're going to see it reject one more time back down into this level of about 500, worst case 450. I think from there, price will end up holding, but I don't think that we're entirely out of the woods at this point. Now, I do have SMCI calls that I've been holding for a very, very long time. They are completely nuked. They're gonna expire worthless coming up on the 16th. But I do think that there's a good chance in the short term to ride SMCI back up to 680, setting a stop loss at lower lows. And then once we reject, give it some time to pull back, we could get a really, really good long term position here or even six to 12 month out calls if price pulls back to 440 or $400. I hope this video helped, guys. If you want to learn everything that we went over in this video, all of our courses are completely free. We go over all the exact indicators that we use. We teach you guys everything from risk management, going over how to read charts, how to trade options, everything. All of our courses are completely free for you guys down in the description. Thank you for all the support. I'll see you next time.